everybody, it's me, the Knitty Gritty Yarn Girl, and welcome to Virtual Vogue Knitting Live. It's really nice to be here. Um, this is our second go-round at Virtual Vogue Knitting, and you know it's a little different than going to New York City, uh, which would where which would be where we would normally go from Connecticut, where we look where we are located. Uh, but you know what? It's really nice to be able to reach out and touch so many people in an intimate setting uh, as opposed to the roaring marketplace that we go to. And they're both great. This is just different. So welcome and welcome to our little studio here. Um, to give you a little bit of an outline as to what Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl is all about, we function out of a 25-foot minibus that has been converted into a yarn shop on wheels. So we offer home parties, we have events that we go to, we do fiber festivals, and we also host retreats, as well as our online shopping experience for you. We, um, our online shopping has always been a part of our business. And now with the new way of shopping for so many things, um, that has just gotten stronger for us. So we are now currently servicing 44 of the 50 states um, and servicing meaning that we have shipped to all those states as well as Canada and um, Australia, the Netherlands, Scotland. And we just had someone on our recent post from New Zealand. So here we are all over the world our little teeny tiny um, studio that we have carved out of the lower level of our house to bring our shop to you. So thank you so much for joining us. Uh, today, um, I would like to hear a little bit from you all. Thank you for joining us on Facebook. So you can feel free to put in the chat box, in the comments, anything you would like. And I'd love for you to start off by just letting us know that you're here and telling us where you're from. So if you kind of put that in the chat box, so we, we know where, where, uh, where we're, how far out we're reaching, that would be great to know. And, um, so I'm going to give you a little bit of an overview of our shop, and then I'm going to focus in on a few things. We work with both independent dyers, up and coming dyers, um, and some large distributing companies. So what you'll find in our shop is um, what I like to say, the best quality for the best price we can offer it. Um, we have a variety of uh, we've everything from a fingering weights to super bulkies and cotton. Now my husband's saying that's like reaching to his little tummy, super bulky, but no, He's not a super bulky man at all. Anyway, we've got cottons and wools and so you name it, we've got the full line of products here for you at Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl. And you'll hear me talk about my husband or talk to my husband while we're uh, filming because he is my director and producer. We have some comments. Tina Lonergan, that's awesome. Tina Hi, Lonergan Tina. says she is from Connecticut. Yes, I know. I've shipped a few things to you. <laughs> Patricia says, waving from Nevada. That's Patricia Prenderville. Hi, Patricia. Thank you and welcome. Thank you so much for joining us. Um, I don't know if you've been to other Vogue knitting uh, marketplaces so far today. We decided to you know, kind of pop ourselves right in the middle of the day and see how that goes. So we will be joining you uh, today, tomorrow, Saturday, and Sunday at 3 p.m. Eastern. And we're gonna do our best to vary what we show you each day so that we can give you a full view of our shop. If there's something you see, don't hesitate to uh, type it in the, in the comments so that we can be sure to get back to you and tell you more about it. You'll find a lot of kits on our website. We prefer to work with kits. Um, we, we have, yarn by the by the skein which we do offer as well but you will see more kits than that offered we'd like kind of like to take the mystery out of the skein and help you to see beyond it so we'll do things like this right here this is a a pattern that's on ravelry it's the anchor shirt and we've knitted it up here in noro um in noro uh my goodness my sonata <laughs> no is that Sonata? No, that is not Sonata. 
Let me just grab it because I've got, Noro has so many great yarns now. They've gone way beyond that. This is Kumo. Thank you very much, Brain, for not kicking in. This is Noro Kumo. And um, great little top-down sweater. Has some nice detail to it without getting crazy. Um, I've already washed it and um, and dried it flat, and it comes out beautifully. So, so you'll see kits like this on our website. Um, this is the anchor shirt. Yes. All right. We have Marilyn Bressler from Long Island, New York. Hi, Marilyn. I'm a Jersey girl. <laughs> we have Crispy Arthurs from Hello from New Zealand. Oh, there, you were just you were just on our website there, weren't you? <laughs> And she says, a very cold winter and knitting helps. Ah, there you go. Well, we, we're sure to give you some, some, offer you some great things there uh, that we can show you and ship to you out there in New Zealand. Um, another great product that you'll see, I'm, you know, I'm going to try to stay a little bit on summer right now. Um, I've kind of focused this whole week on our, uh, at our, at our business. We're kind of calling it our transition time. So, you know, we're kind of helping you get from summer and starting to think about some fall, um, some fall projects. But just remember that we've got some real summer months still ahead of us or some, some summer weather still ahead of us. I'm going to set this down so that I can use both my hands. This is a really pretty piece. This is called the Solar Flare. And we have this kit on our website. And this is knitted from, from Huasco Cotton. Uh, very, very lovely multi-colored cotton yarns. Very, here, let me show you that from the back so you can see how pretty that shows up. Looks like angelic wings. Well, thank you. <laughs> they would be mine then, my angelic wings. So this is Solar Flare and it's on our website. And let me let me just show you, I'm gonna grab a couple of the pretty colors that um, this yarn comes in. And you'll see these all on our site. And Crispy Arthur says she just woke up. Well, well, good morning. <laughs> I, hope, I hope you're enjoying your morning coffee with us. Um, so these are just some of the colors of the solar flare uh, or of the, um, the Huasco cotton. And if you look up solar flare on our website, you will see it. You will see all the colors that we offer. And while I'm on this yarn... There was another very, very popular kit this summer, or a popular pattern this summer on Ravelry called Breathe and Hope. And so we decided to offer it in both a cotton and a wool version. So this happens to be the cotton. And again, done in Huasco cotton and My Little Sunshine, uh, which if you're a fan of Jody Long's, you will love My Little Sunshine. It's a great cotton yarn. And um, so that's, this is um, Breathe and Hope, Casa Pink. Oh, you can tell my, my samples get, uh, get touched a lot. And they might get touched by the cat when he decides to come down and lay on the sofa and get himself cozy. Um, so just a couple of things. So let's just stick with Summer for a moment. And um, there's a lovely cotton and linen blend put out by Juniper Moon Farm. Uh, it's called Zoe. And just to give you an idea of how Zoe knits up, this is a merina top. Uh, it's just it's just a great summer weight cotton to uh, you know to, to put on, on on a warm day and then for something for the cool nights just to show you a little something else about how this yarn knits up really fun that cotton and linen blend has some really nice drape to it so one of the things that we decided to do with zoe this summer is to offer it in a tote bag and so you'll find on our website hold on a second yes a couple of things so crispy says yes just woke up and she says we have location no we have lockdown in the far north of our country just starting to make us feel safe from our prime minister. <laughs> and Gail Vaughn says, will you show the teal vest behind you? Oh, I think she means that mm. one so much for summer, huh? Yeah, I'll be happy to show that to you. That's one of my favorites. Um, I just finished it too. So exciting. Anyway, 
Let's go back here for one second to Zoe. This is a little simple tote that we put together using Zoe knit, uh, Zoe um, cotton and linen. And this is just a fun little summer piece. And so it's one skein of each color. And we showed you two different ways that we've done it. We did a multicolor and a solid. And we did narrow, you know, narrow blocking stripes. And then we did equal stripes here. So you'll find these on our website as well. This is a great little kit. And I think, yes, just one skein of each color. And we have our friend Rita Johnson Cotterman. Hello, waving emoji from Northern from California. Northern California. Is that, was she from Eureka? I believe she might be. We have to ask her. She might tell us now that she knows we want to know. Okay, so who asked the question about this? Crispy says teal, yum. Okay, so Gail Vaughn says, will you show the teal vest behind you? Okay, the teal vest behind me is knitted with a brand new yarn by Jody Long. And <coughs> don't you just feel like, you know, people love to carry baskets of fruits and vegetables. I love to carry baskets of yarn. It's just so, it's such fun. So, Andiamo. This is a Peruvian wool and alpaca blend. So gorgeous, gorgeous yarn, super bulky. The yarns have not even come in yet. So this kit is on our website. This is called the Timber Run Vest. The kit is on our website. And um, one of the things I really love about the super bulky, about the Andiamo, is the yardage you get. You've got 175 yards in each hank here. So, you know, it's an ample amount of yarn for a super bulky. Rita Johnson Cotterman says, yes, Eureka, cool face emoji. Linda Crawford says, good afternoon from Mississippi. Hi, Linda. And we have Naomi Braswell. Good afternoon from Millersville County, Pennsylvania, waving hand emoji. So, um, and how many, yes. Crispy Arthur says, blimey cool. <laughs> so let me show you this. Um, let me tell you a little bit about this timber run vest. So I told you about the yarn. Um, it is a beautiful yarn to work with. I really enjoyed working with it, even though it's a bulky wool. I I have arthritis in my thumbs. Well, not anymore. I don't. I have new thumbs. But um, you know, sometimes they don't act the way I would want them to, and they work better with finer yarns. But this, I really had a great time working with the yarn. And I use my likey needles, which I think have a, a lot to do with that. And I'll show you the likey needles in a minute. So this has got a, you know, you've got your cable running across the center front with an off-center um, closure. And I love this high neckline. So the, the neckline has, you know, you can button that all the way up. And oh, oh, just watching it drape here. And look at the stitch definition in this, really nice. Oh, by the way, for those of you who um, have not seen Nitty Gritty Yarn Girls, a Monday night twisted stitches show, last week, not this past Monday, but a week ago Monday, we had a blocking demonstration on the show and I blocked this, I wet blocked it. That was very brave of me, wet blocking something this heavy on the show, but it worked and it worked beautifully. And you can find that wet blocking and that whole show on our um, YouTube page, right? On our yep. YouTube channel, Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl on YouTube. Um, so that's on there as well. So make then, sure to subscribe to our channel when you look at that okay. also. Well, thank you, Paul, for reminding me of that. So here we are in the back. So you're, you have a center back panel and then you have your sides and then the center front panel with the off center closure. Really very pretty. And, um, the toggle buttons, they had toggle buttons on the pattern, and I tried a few other buttons, but I just think that the toggles work great. You don't want anything to take away from the beautiful design on this on this sweater. So that is the, the Timber Run vest. Okay, Gail Vaughn wants to know, what is the pattern again for the teal vest? That is Timber Run. And Crispy Arthur's bulky right now is the best in our cold days. Ah, we have Michelle K. Moore. Hi, what is the name of the sweater you showed made with the Juniper Moon Zoe Cotton Line yarn? Thanks so much. This, okay, the, the Juniper Moon Cotton. Okay, we have two. We have two. We have the Marina Top, which is the sleeveless. 
little lace. And then we have the thick, Thecla sweater, the Thecla sweater. And I can get both these patterns for you as well as the yarn. If we don't have, we don't happen to have these on our website because I just got these two uh, things in for the show. I can always put that together for you. You can look at the, um, on our website, look at the tote bags. They're called Simple Tote. And you can see all the different colors that we offer. And I can get anything that, you know, I can get the colors that you like. So, yes. Paul. Naomi Braswell <laughs> says, love the neckline with cable stitch. Truly awesome creation. And Crispy Arthurs follows up with, hmm, I want this teal kit. <laughs> also says we have 15 degrees right now so. wow is it that cold there i'm thinking express shipping yeah <laughs> as soon as it comes in so when you order the the timber run right now it tells it tells you right on the website that it's a pre-order because those should be in wait a minute, let me see i can tell you a little more about when they will be expected and michelle says thanks so much oh you're welcome thank you um, the Andiamo yarns should be in the beginning of October. So if you order it now, at least you'll reserve your color. I already have one, uh, one order for the yarn. So at least you get your color reserved and, uh, we can, we can get you started with that. And as soon as it comes in, it will get shipped out. Um, uh, so that's that. Any other questions on the Zoe? And so we will move slowly over to one of my, um, actually Mirasol has been doing such great things with their yarns. Mirasol is um, imported from Peru and there's a, a, a full, there's a whole Mirasol project where the organization works with people, with the children in Peru who are mostly uh, children of farmers and, and shepherds who help who help them to have better schooling and better ways of life um, rather than working in the fields all day. So Mirasol Yarns is doing some great things for the folks out in Peru. And um, Pima, Pima Kuri is their new cotton brand, um, their new cotton line. I have a few of the colors here. And there's a great sweater. And just so you know, the, these things that I'm showing you, the Zoe, and the Pima Kori sweater that I'm about to show you. Now, these came in about a half hour before the show came on today. So I haven't had a chance to get all these things on our site yet. Um, but this, look how pretty that sweater is. If, the, if you have interest in this sweater, it's called the Tegan Pullover. T-E-A-G-E-N, T-E-A-G-A-N Pullover. And spelling doesn't count. I will I will figure out what it is you're looking for. Just uh, put a note in the comment section, and I'll be sure to get you all the details on this and anything that you see that uh, may not be up on our website currently. So this is the Reese sweater. I mean the um, the Tegan pullover, and that is in Pima Kuri cotton by Mirasol. I just love how the colors. Um, I, well, I actually love this this little Trinity stitch in here. Really pretty. And I love the way it loops at the neckline. They did a great job here. And then bringing that um, that stripe over so that you, you know, the, the stripes are consistent throughout. Nice job with that. I don't know who the designer was on that one. I don't think I have it here, but it's very, very lovely. Nicely done. Um, and another Mirasol product that um, I just, fell in love with is Chi Chi. And Chi Chi is a cotton and, and linen blend and some, let me see, let me grab the Chi Chi right here. Crispy Arthur says, gosh, I will be ready for my winter next year with the teal <laughs> kit. As October, we start warming up and spring showing off and summer moving in. Wow, you're like opposite us. I guess we'll have to visit New Zealand sometime. Okay, so Chi Chi is an alpaca, linen, viscose, and micro tweed. So that is our lovely, lovely. And it, this is such a new yarn that there, there's, there are not as many kits or, or garment samples available 
but this chinchy, this little shawl, the Reese shawl is on our website and it's in all the different colors. And let me just put that over my shoulder so you can see how this fits and how it looks. So that's the Reese shawl. And what I'll do is after the show, I will be very happy to post the links to all these different things so that you can, um, if there's something you saw that you like, I'll be happy to respond with the link to that particular product. So this one is on our website. And um, just as you stopped me for the Timber Run vest, if there's something else you see as we're walking through, I'm on my way to something else, don't hesitate to put a little comment there and stop me in my tracks. I'm happy to stop for you. Um, you know, there's not a day goes by that somebody doesn't enjoy a good sale. So we do have a couple of items here that, um, that I'm offering right now on our website. This is the Infinity Shawl by Katia. It is, the colors are fabulous in this. I have just a few colors left. Um, we've got the, the teal and the, and the navy and the red and purple. And the Infinity Shawl is... 100% virgin wool. It's this skein. This this cake is 656 yards, and it normally sells for 39.99 for the kit, the the yarn and the pattern. And it is on our website on sale right now for 29.99. And the pattern is, you get these two patterns with the kit. So that is the infinity shawl. And then, oops, we also have, if you're getting ready for spring out there in New Zealand, we've got some great indulgence mini shawl kits. These are adorable. They've got, the colors are fun on these. Great little um, mini, mini skeins. And these are on the website as well. And this is called Indulgence Mini Kit. I hope you're writing out all those lovely things. Queensland United. Uh, Queensland, yeah, this is Queensland United. I don't know if you're familiar with this yarn. This is a um, fingering to sport weight yarn. And there are 1,531 yards on this cake. And it is an organic lamb's wool and cotton. Sells for $24.95. I do believe I have it on our website right now for $19.95 or $20.95 on the website right now. And it comes with a, um, a pattern as well. So there are just a few. That we have only the red and the pink left. That is it. So if you're interested in those, jump on them. They're going to be gone. Chris B. Arthur says, yes, beautiful country, and you can work it so you have a short winter, summer in both countries. We have some beautiful wools here also. You will love it all, especially way down south in Queenstown and Otago County. We love spring colors. <laughs> well, we got them for you. You know, if you look at, at uh, the lovely <coughs> colors that we have in our shop, I'm so, I'm so proud of what we have built here at Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl in three short years. And um, we just love our fans. We've just reached 2,000 fans on Facebook. And that is very, very exciting. And we know that without you, we would be nothing. So we, our goal is always to provide you with amazing customer service. It's all about the experience for you. And without you, we are not, we do not have Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl. Um, when you when you purchase a project from us, a, um, a kit, if you will, um, that kit comes with the pattern, the yarn, uh, we include a little Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl project bag in there for you. And what you get is something special that you don't get at very, very many online shops. And that is our personal support. I am only a phone call, a text, an email, a FaceTime away for anything you need for any of the projects that you buy from us. Elizabeth Forrester says, and 100 days with no cases in New Zealand. Uh, 
And Fitzgerald Patton says, what is the pale green shawl next to the juniper moon? And Crispy says, yes, Liz. Pale green shawl next to the juniper moon. Oh, wait a minute. Next to the juniper moon, which one? Pale green shawl. <laughs> I don't know which one you're talking about. There's a lot of green in this shop. <laughs> Next to the juniper moon. Give me a second. Juniper moon. This juniper moon? There isn't any pale green next to that juniper moon. Okay, I'm going to keep looking. Let's see if you can give me a better direction. Uh, to follow you. Hmm. I'm a little lost here. Annie, can you uh, kind of direct us to where you'd like us to to look. I don't know. Pale green. I'm looking to see. Pale green is here. I don't know. Is it this? Unless it's this. Maybe this looks pale green on the screen. Mm -hmm. Okay, then we're going to keep going. And when you let us know where to go uh, in our shop, we will go there for you. And um, and we'll we'll show you what we want. These are just, we've got a few of these left. This is a Bacatia Oh, oh it's, hold on. Uh, oh. She says it's next to the rust colored sweater. Next to the rust colored sweater. That's this one? Oh, is this that the, green? Is this the shawl you're talking about? Solar flare. That could be it. Because this is Juniper. No, it's not Juniper Moon Farm. But let's see if this is it. If this is the one she's looking at. Um, and see if we can help you with that. We're going to hold on to this one and see if that's it. This is the solar flare shawl. Really pretty. This, yes, that's the one. Okay, this Perfect. sits, this Thank sits you. lovely on the shoulder. Um, you know, sometimes you're always, you're always moving around the shawl and that's why you carry shawl pins and you're always, always shifting your, you know, trying to fix your shawls. What I like about this is that it's a circular shawl, so it sits very nicely on your shoulders, and you don't have to worry about it falling off. And really pretty, very very pretty, lovely work. And that is that is knitted in uh, Huasco cotton, and there are lovely colors on our website. I had a few of them out before. I'll be happy to grab them really quickly again for you, so you can just see just a couple of things here. Yeah, look, I think I actually grabbed three different colors than I had before. So, oh, oh, there they are, Paul, right there. Oh. So you can see some of the different colors. Really, really pretty. Great variety. And it knits up so nice. Knits up beautifully. So that's Solar Flares on our website. And that's a kit. That is a kit as well. Speaking of kits, um... Those of you who are not from the U.S., excuse us one moment while we talk about Patriot Games, which is a red, white, and blue scarf that was, uh, or shawl that was created by um, one of my dear friends. And the reason I'm holding this is because she created it and now she owns it because she had the yard. And so I am... our website this year do you have another comment no it was an incoming call that i had to oh, knock off okay so um pa patriot games if you are interested in that that is on our website and i'm just gonna rita this. johnson cotterman says gorgeous solar flare shawl and crispy arthur says name again of that teal vest and pattern please timber run and if you just put timber in the search bar um, and I'll be sure to send you the link to that after the show, uh, if you'd like. I'll be happy to do that for you. Um, let's see something else I wanted to bring up was, um, I talked a little bit before about Jody Long. And uh, Jody is originally from England, from the UK, and he is currently living in Turkey. I'm trying to find the book I wanted to show you. Um, 
You would walk over to the Devon shawl in the corner, Paul, while I'm getting to this. Here it is. I knew I, I knew I find it. If you love to, you know, if you love to look through pattern books and and get some ideas, the Summer Breeze book by Jody Long is a, a great little book. It's got eight designs in it, and each one of them, if one is nicer than the other. And the, I had Paul walk over to the Devon shawl because this has been another very popular item. Uh, you know, if you're here for the first time at uh, coming to us uh, with virtual Vogue knitting, this is your first time seeing. Uh, and Jody's Jody's uh, Devon shawl has been very, very popular. And Chris B. Arthur says, yes, please. Cheers. And um, this is another one. If you like the solar flare shawl, the Whitby by Jody is uh, very, very lovely as well. It's got that same shape to it. It's got some buttons on the top. I don't know if you can see that, Paul. And we're going to be having another Jody Long truck show coming up. Um, I think the Jody one is at the end of October um, with some of his new products as well. But this is a great kit. The the webs on our website we have the Summer Breeze book. Tina, oh, oh, Tina Lonergan said, I made that shawl. Oh, did you? And you didn't put a picture on the on our uh, Facebook page. You need to do that. You need to do that. We love to see the projects. And I, I can't remember which colors you did, Tina. But um, so this book is great. The book is on the website as well as the Devon shawl and, um, and the Whitby and a couple of other individual pattern kits from this book as well um and i believe the book comes with the um no the book does not come because the patterns were available separately so we've got those as well but you can get the book with it if you'd like so there we have that and um winter so as we transition a little bit uh from one season to the next a couple of things We've already jumped into super bulky as uh, as our friends from New Zealand are coming out of winter and we are going into winter. But there is something that is happening um, starting September 1st that um, we're going to be participating here at Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl and we hope that you might join us. And that is a knit along. Um, it's actually our first knit along and it is uh, being uh, run by Art Yarns, an Irish trier from Art Yarns Yarns um, in uh, White Plains, New York. And I don't know if you've ever had the opportunity to see Iris's, uh, or I should say Art Yarns Yarns, but they are actually hand painted. The yarns are Merino and Cashmere. The, 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 we, now we carry the Merino cloud. And um, so we're pretty exclusive with what we carry from Art Yarns. We carry the Merino Cloud and the Beaded Silken Sequins. And the, the knit along that's coming up is called Straight on the Bias. And you can see the lovely, and we're, we're still test knitting the pattern. So the knit along starts in September, but you can order your yarns now. Let me see if I can hold that down. There you go. Just to give you an idea of how this pattern runs. If you look at the at the beginning, how you have the little tiny mosaics and the um, the I cord edging is gorgeous. Then it goes into a garter. And then I, this is what I call the fleur de lis pattern in here. And then it moves to garter again. And then you start with the boxes. And as you if you look on the website, you'll see the the samples that are growing along the way as people are knitting them to see how it how it's coming out. Chris Arthur says, tasty also that shawl. Yes. And Tina Longren, Longren says, okay, on your comment to post the picture. Perfect. And Mary Williamson, do you have the Noro Sonata Silver Leaf Shawl Kit to show? I sure do. <laughs> I'll be happy to show it to you. Let me just finish up with the colors here. For the um, for this knit along, it's if, if you would just slowly spin around here. And we can do it fast now. Our we signal has greatly improved. And by the way, those of you who have seen us before, you may notice that we've got 
much better internet service than here. Yay. It only took us three months to figure it out, but we got it and we did it all for you. Um, so just to give you an idea of how the kits work, I'm going to use this combination because this is really starking. Look at that. So this is one of the combinations for the straight on the bias kit. The kits can be purchased with or without beads. So the kit without the beads would be one skein of each color of your choice of kit. And then if you would like to, you can order it with the beads as well. The beads will be used on the, um, on the edging, the trim of the shawl, just to give it a little bit extra kick, if you will. It's absolutely gorgeous. I've, we've made several um, projects using Merino Cloud and the uh, beaded silken sequence. And it's, it's always a stunning project, just always. So you'll see some of the colors here. Go on our website. It's called Straight on the Bias. The patterns will come out in September. Reserve your yarns now. We have these are the kits that that I created specifically for this um, this project, but I've put together some other combinations using art yarns yarns as well that you can choose from. And this one's I did pair this up with I can't remember with what, but there's you know that one is an, another very very pretty combination. So someone wanted to know about the silver leaf shawl. This is knitted with Noro Kumo, uh, Nor 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 Noro Sonata. Thank you, brain, for kicking in. You know, they're, they're bo they both come in a similar hank. They're similar weights. And I get them confused sometimes when I'm talking too much. So here's the silver leaf shawl. Absolutely beautiful. So you've got your lace design, some eyelets in there, garter stitch. It's an asymmetrical triangle. The size is very nice. And let me see if I can. And we have a variety of colors on the website. Well, it's not really fixed beautifully, but at least you can see how long it is. And, you know, you can wear it lots of different ways. And if you wanted to just, you know, use it to put over your shoulders. Also very, very pretty. Really nice. I love this one. This is a great seller too. Very popular. Chris P. Arthur says, yes, love the Noro yarns. Followed up by Rita Johnson Cotterman says, love the color of the silver leaf. Brenda Dixon Berger, silver leaf is lovely. Tina Longren. Oh, yes, I made two of them, and Crispy <laughs> says stunning. Yeah. Um, the silver leaf, let me show you here more of the colors that we have. And Mary Williamson, gorgeous. Thank you. You are very welcome. So we've got in the sil for the silver leaf, to show you some of the other colors we have, we've got the black and the, uh, the citron and the cranberry. Denim. Denim is very popular. In, in this shawl as well. Really nice. And then the gray. So lots of different color. Co oh, and then there's the white, of course. Whoop. And then there's the white. So you'll find all those colors on the website ready and waiting for you to enjoy them. And then again, the pattern comes with it. So lots of goodies for you. Um, Hope you weren't planning on sitting, Paul. No. <laughs> um, one of the newer kits that we offered this just in the past couple of weeks is Always Be Brave. And this is really very, very pretty. This is, again, another of these shawls that is nice and long. Again, when I think about the trend, again, when I think about transitioning weather, you know, I think about something that's going to be warm and long enough to keep me to wrap around my shoulders. And this certainly does that. And the yarns that we use for this and the size of this is on our website. Oh, it looks really pretty when you do that. So what this is, is you have your solid on one side with the variegated yarn as your accent. And then as you get halfway through, you go to the variegated yarn with the solid as your accent. 
and we when for this kit we've paired rainbow beach crispy says your cranberry color looks rust my cranberry color looks rust um could be on the screen okay yeah it could be on the screen oh that cranberry color oh yeah it's um it does have a little bit of a of a, a rust tint to it yeah it does but it's more red than it is orange and pan laven derner says beautiful thank you thank you so this one um gadifra gadifra is a lovely um italian yarn this is a lot of mia uni and this is a sock weight yarn this is actually a great sock yarn too if you're if you're a lover of socks gadifra makes fabulous sock yarns so this is a super wash virgin wool with a little bit of polyamide in it so what we've done is we've paired up the rainbow beach with this in different color combinations to create the always be brave kits you know and you might you know i might have put this with that one the gold and then there's a, the this is the the one that we had is the that i showed you knitted up is this with the red um some really pretty combinations uh, let me show you There's this right here. Whoops. This is another great combination for that shawl if you like the brights. And then up here. So you'll see these all up there at nittygrittyyarngirl.com. Uh, this is called Always Be Brave. We have a great search on our website. It makes it really easy for you if you just type in the first. If you want to... Um, our friend from uh, from New Zealand loves Noro. If you just put Noro in the search bar, you're gonna be surprised at all the groovy things you see. Well, yeah. Crispy Arthur says thanks, and Anna Maria says catching some of the show at work. Don't uh -huh. tell. I'm not telling. Smiling anybody. emoji. <laughs> and Crispy Arthur says sex, uh, socks yarn gold is tasty. Also, yeah, that's a great little yarn. It's super. Um, and you know what's really fun is we got some new sock yarns in uh, just recently from online. Uh, I love the designs that here, just to give you an idea, whoopsie, of what the finished sock comes out like in these designs. Fun, right? So this is the purple right here. And those socks, all these colors are on our website for the socks. But you know what's really cool is you can do this in this color. And you can do your toe and your heel in that. Fun? I think, anyway. Or then, and then what you can do is you can switch around and do your toe and your heel in this and your sock in that. So it's a lot of fun to, and, and um I think my husband has been shamed into allowing me to make him a pair of socks because he always says he won't wear them. But I think maybe, I think I might've convinced him. Actually, I think- it Was Jeff Dunning. I think it was a, a Jeff Grill. Jeff Grill. Jeff Grill convinced you. Yes, one of our uh, our Knitting Fever friends convinced him. So those are uh, you know a little bit of sock yarn to give you an idea of what's uh, going on there with socks. Crispy says, husband, a friend in Pennsylvania will love the gold socks. Oh, oh really? <laughs> so you have a friend in Pennsylvania from New Zealand. Cool. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent. Um, at the top here is our, our version of the Papillon butterfly shawl. This another very, very popular shawl on... Um, on Ravelry. I believe there's a butterfly papillon cult, if you will. Um, they are such a group of folks who have knitted this pattern, knitted this pattern, and it's just the combinations that you see of papillon are just unbelievable. This was my, I, I, you know, I wanted something, I love that striking reverse color where most people are looking for the striking uh, multicolor. So that's why, you know, you have a little bit of everything for all the different uh, things.
the different tastes and in, in, in uh, minds out there. So for that, we we're combining again the Lana Mia Uni with, and I'm trying to find the Perth. Where did my Perth go? Where is my Perth? I can't find it right now. Recipe says, cool. They visited me here about six years ago. Ah, oh, wow. How fun is that? <coughs> so here you go. Here you have Perth. And here's one of the combinations that you can do that. Now, what a lot of people choose to do, because this rainbow beach or rainbow reef is so striking, they put the black with it for the contrast. So if you've never, if you've been intrigued by the Papillon and you've never, and you've said, oh, I don't know, it looks like an awful lot of work. If you can do a short row, if you can do a wrap and turn, you got this. The pattern can be a little confusing to read, but that's why you have me. I can help you just kind of decipher what that designer is asking you to do, what they had in their mind. And that's why we, we do our best to knit everything we offer and if we haven't knitted it ourselves we make sure that we read through that pattern and we understand everything before we put it out there for you so lots of great combinations um for the um the papillon one yep. of my favorites crispy says it was no more like before 2010 and Ann Fitzgerald Patterson says, what colors did you use? Oh, did I use? I used Queen Victoria. I used Queen Victoria and the coral. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> Christmas just, is magic papillon colors. Yeah, they are. They are just amazing. And I just find it so interesting how they cluster. You know, the colors just cluster beautifully. Um, so you wouldn't think that that's how that would come out. But look at, see, now you can see this here is right in through here. And the deep purples are, you know, you can find them. So if you, you know, if you look at it, you can see, oh, yeah, I get that now. And so where you may think people have changed yarns all those times, what they're doing is they're just depending on the striping in that yarn to make it work. And it does beautifully and these two uh combinations of yarns are fantastic together crispy says you're going to make me broke before christmas <laughs> well maybe you can make some christmas gifts and then you won't feel so broke <laughs> so crispy how did you learn about us i'd love to know how you learned about us i mean was it maybe just through vogue getting live i'm i'm curious because uh, there are so many people that we met through the Vogue, um, the, the Vogue marketplace that they had last time, and we really appreciated that. That's why we decided to do it again. So it was uh, really nice to be to to meet them all. Make sure to like our Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl page because we do a lot of co uh, content uploads, and that way you won't miss out. Right, because every time we introduce something new, it goes up on our website first, and then uh, you know, and then it's on our we feature it on our show. So those are a couple of the projects. Uh, the Papillon shawl is on our website in two different sizes. I, you probably can't tell by looking on a TV screen, but I'm less than, I'm under five feet tall. So I didn't, for me, I wanted to have my Papillon shawl doesn't, is not as long as some of the others. Uh, so that's, that call, is called the Petite Papillon. Ann Fitzgerald Patton wants to know, what color did you show with the black? Oh, that was Rainbow Reef. And that's this one. Uh, yeah. Let me show you. You can see it better in that. This one is wound differently. Isn't it funny how you look, those are exactly the same color, exactly the same dye lot, yet when they, you know, when they wind it into the ball, they show up so differently. So that's Rainbow Reef I showed with black. Now someone did Rainbow Reef. And Michelle, okay, oh. Look at that one. 
So I guess it all depends on how you want it to be. And Michelle K. Moore, are you offering a coupon code for the Vogue Knitting Live? Oh my gosh, I forgot to put it up. Yes, it is VK Live, and you will get free shipping on anything over $50. Now, because my brain did not get it up there ahead of time, if you order something before the show, you know, before today, before I get a chance to go do it right now, um, I will refund your shipping for you. So fear not, you will get your shipping back if you order something before the coupon code gets up. Okay. Thank you so much for reminding me. I'm sorry about that. I just was trying to get the other things up and I forgot all about that one. So it's just put VK live um, and, or in the notes, just put Vogue and I will give you your, your um, refund on your shipping. All right. Chris Barthes says, by looking up Noro threads after getting my Noro knitting mag from the UK just days ago, you popped up just like magic, ah. a brush of fresh air with knitting. <laughs> so what she's talking about is the Vogue Fall magazine. It's called issue. It's uh, issue number 17. It was just released and we're going to be doing a trunk show just on this magazine coming in November. You can stay right there while I look up my date. Crispy says, we need you here in New Zealand. Well, <laughs> Crispy, we are in New Zealand via the web. We are everywhere. Okay. The Noro trunk show, if you want to put this on your calendar, is um, Monday, September 21st at 8 p.m. Eastern. And it will be on our, our Monday night show, which is called Twisted Stitches, by the way. Um, it deserves its own name. So if you've not had a chance to look at this magazine yet, let me show you just a couple of things that I have fallen in love with, which said, I this is why I wanted to do the trunk show. So this is one. This is already on the website. Sweeto. This is called, this yarn is called Sweeto. T-S-U-I-D-O. It's a brand new yarn by Noro. And take a look at some of these colors. And Crispy says, I got issue 16 in two weeks. Ah, so this is it. These are some of the colors that we have in right now. More to come, but this is what we've got. So the Sweeto is a, let me read this to you. This is a bulky weight. There are... 320 meters, so that's uh, over 300, maybe about 340 yards on here, and it is just stunning. So that's one of the things that's in this book, one of the projects that is in this book. Um, and then there's brioche for those of you who are love, who are brioche fans. Bachi, Bachi is another bulky weight, and I love the fit on this sweater. Oftentimes today we're finding that so many sweaters are top down and there's not a whole lot of shape to them. You know, I don't need something to hug, but I do like to, you know, to have something. I'd like to know that my clothes are on my body. And um, this has a beautiful, a lovely, lovely shape to it. Um, those of us who, who, if you like a more boxy shape, we have those as well. This is another very, very pretty piece in here. So you can see the lovely designs. Uh, there are some newer yarns. We're going to be featuring this magazine, but there will also be projects in it from 16 and 15 that feature Akari. Um, I don't know if, if you've worked with Akari yet. This is one of the softest Noro yarns out there. I just love Akari and the fiber content. This is an org. This is the origami shawl. This is an origami shawl that is on our website. And Akari is silk, cotton, viscose, mohair, wool, and palamide. Um, if, if you love Noro and you, you love Noro for its original um, texture, Akari Subami are going to get a uh, Sonata. Those yarns are going to give you a whole different side of Noro that you haven't seen before. Really, really beautiful.
So, yep, that's just to give you a, this is, this is Neuro Ito. And then these are Akari's, Subami. Great colors. They're because Noro is just, you know, it talks about being in touch with nature. And, you know, his yarns just show that the, the palettes that he uses when he creates are just so lovely. Whether they're subdued, subdued or vibrant, they all make a statement, each of their own. So um, you can always uh, buy with confidence knowing that Noro, you know, Noro yarns are always going to live up to that brand and, um, and the quality of that brand. Chris Bjartha says, I am now 8 a.m. New Zealand time, Friday, and beautiful juniper for no beautiful jumper for winter bright uh-huh yep yep they call sweaters jumpers across the pond as we say right across the pond fall and is uh i like to call it sparkle and fluff you're going to there's going to be a lot of mohair there's going to be a lot of mohair out there Gonna be a lot of sparkle, and so on our show tomorrow um, uh, and and Friday and Saturday, you'll be seeing more and more of the uh, the, the different things that are be going to be coming up for fall. Uh, we're going to talk about our fifty mohair shades, fifty shades of mohair as opposed to fifty shades of gray in that lovely uh, book that we all saw about. This is so we're going to be talking about fifty shades of mohair tomorrow. Um, and over the weekend, you can find that on our website. We've got some great, um, other items here that are using mohair, Silky Kid. Just, uh, so keep an eye out on that. We'll be doing more Noro tomorrow. This is Noro. So, you know, all of, we're doing our best to bring you a variety of yarns throughout our shop with the projects that we offer so that you have a taste for who we are and we can you know we can service your needs whether you are in the u.s or overseas we just love working with each and every one of you so i'm going to leave the the floor open for for questions and, and comments before we close up for the day um but any questions that you have you can um please feel free to ask us. As a matter of fact, Paul, why don't you just browse through the shop while I put that discount up? Okay. So I'm going to, I'm going to post that up here before our show closes this morning, this afternoon. So if there's anything that anyone would like to order, we can take care of that for them. And if you see something while Paul is walking around, be sure to stop him. So the discount is free shipping on orders over $50. And why is that? Okay. Let me see if I can just reactivate this other one. That expired. Okay. And Crispy says, chairs and mohair is just so to do. <laughs> okay. We got it. We're coming with it. Your discount code will be live in okay vk live free shipping so for those of our friends who are in different countries there will be a Okay, so 
Okay, we got that. Minimum purchase, okay, $50. Everyone. Then it ends on. And Crispy says, the teal, how many balls of wool will I need for that beautiful vest, please? Uh, one moment and I will tell you. And time at midnight. That beautiful vest, and I can find it easier this way for you. Okay. For from an extra, extra small to an extra large, we'll take three hanks. And then the trip, the double X and triple X take four hanks. Plus pattern, please. Yep, four hanks. Okay, so that's what you need for that. Um, this is what I do. I save my, I save my wrappers so I know exactly what I use and I, Calculate that out for all of you. So thank you all for joining us today on a virtual Vogue Knitting Live. We appreciate you. We appreciate you taking the time to be with us. And thank you very much. I look forward to answering all your questions and maybe seeing you again tomorrow and over the weekend. See you soon. Make sure you share this. Let your friends know that we're going to be on tomorrow.